we're after the snapper out here and what I've been finding works the best lately is these nice soft plastics by Squidgy got about a 16 ounce head on it with the hook and the, the trick is to try and keep as much hook exposed as you can so I pretty much just put it sort of in the middle a little bit to the top there bring it down till you get about there bring it up through the top and push it right down over that lip there so it stays on nicely that way you've got plenty of hook exposed so when the fish comes along and, and grabs him it's going to get hooked right in the corner of his mouth whoa 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 it's got some power Decent size. I'll just bring him up here and see what we got. Could be a snapper, I don't know. I don't feel those head. Oh, there's a couple of head shakes now. Could be more like a salmon or something, maybe. Let's see. It's a good sign. It was the first, first cast. Just nailed it. Very good sign. I'd say, I don't know, it's hard to tell. It hasn't got those snapper shakes like they do. I reckon it might be it. Oh, it is a snapper. It's a nice snapper. It's a nice snapper, Pete. Yeah. It's a beauty. Let's bring him up here. Of course, I don't, I don't have my... He's well hooked. Yeah, look at that. His uh, his guts are coming out of his mouth. We'll keep him. He'll be a beautiful panty. Is there a hump on his head? He'll be a few kilo. First drop on the squidgy, and that's what we come up with. Beautiful. Get that hook out. So that's what we're using. Just that squidgy. Put a little bit of bit of the S factor on it, and on that drop, he's just come and nailed it. A good size snapper, Pete. Right. So we'll just pop him down under the deck here. Let's see if we can get some more. We'll just we're drifting down this way a little bit, so we'll just cast it back that way. Give it a chance to sink down. Let's see how we go. It's a perfect day for fishing. It's a bit overcast, just a light breeze. Nothing too strong, no white caps. You just when you're dropping it down, they often take it on the drop, so you just keep your hand ready. Just flick it in the gear. Flick the uh over like that. Let that drop right down near the bottom. Definitely some fish down there. There we go, something just took it. No, he's off. We'll just let we'll just leave that jig it around here a bit. Might drop it again on the drop. All of a sudden it just started peeling off line off the reel. There it goes again. Yep, we're in now. So on the drop again, the snapper's taken it. And just flicked it straight into gear. We've got that hook right in his mouth there, hopefully. We've got a good solid hook up. I'd say he's another snapper. Oh. Get that other camera on. Yeah, you can feel those head shakes. It's a snapper. He's actually pulling me up. Up north. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, he's got some power. 
I've got my drift chute out there and he's actually pulling me towards the chute. So now the drift chute's back that way. This little Shimano T-curve rod really, really works well on these snapper. I've got the Stratic, the Stratic reel. It's giving me a good workout. And we've got about 15 pound braid. It's coming up now. Oh, there's a big school of something down here. On the fish vine, it's really showing up some fish. Got me mate Pete out fishing over here. The big school of fish over here, Pete. Got another nice snapper. Bring him up here. Don't get too carried away. Bring him up nice and slow. Oh, I've got a bit of colour there. Another beaut snapper. Oh yes, look at that. Make sure there's no Noahs around. This one you're gonna lose your hand. Of course I don't have a net, as I never do. It's a pretty good hook. Oh, I don't want to lose this one. I'll just grab that there and I'll just drag him up over, over the side. Like that, put your hand down on him, and we have got another fantastic snapper. We've got big humps, these ones. Having a great little session here. Beautiful. We'll get that hook out. You can see that hook's, he's got that hook, that uh, squidgy, the hook's in the corner of his mouth. So we'll get that out, pop him under deck. See so we can get another one on the drop. So that's the lure we're using, putting the S-Factor on the squidgy. It's working an absolute treat. We'll put him down the deck, down under the deck. Just keep your hand on that bar line ready to flick over because they'll grab it and run. You've got to be ready. Yep, there's fish there. In again, Pete! Oh, yes, he's taking that. Whoa, he's screaming off. On the drop again, he's just... I could feel have a bit of a go at it. Flick the bail arm over and we're out straight into another nice snapper here. This is a fantastic session. Free, free drops. And it's going to be free fish if we can get this one up as well. Got some power these fish. You're getting down near the bottom there. A bit reluctant to tighten the drag up. The good fish. The good fish. So I'll just bring him up here. Well, they put up a good fight. I love snapper fishing. You can see them here on the fish find them. They're arcing up down there. About five, six metres up from the bottom. Fishing in 37 metres of water. So they're right down there. He's coming up now. He's got to let him wear themselves out a little bit down deep there. I'll go for a few big runs and then they'll generally come up fairly easy and go for a few more runs. But the main thing is to keep that tension on. coming up now. We'll have a bit of colour soon. Hopefully there'll be no sharks around to take him. There's another good another good snapper. It's another ripper. There he is. Don't have a net. They're well hooked you can see. We'll just drag him up over the side here. My hand on it. So there he is, 
This one's a bit smaller than that last one, but still a great snapper. And you see it well hooked with that squidgy in the top of his mouth there. Get that squidgy out. That's free cast, free fish. We've got the trifecta here. Fantastic. Unbelievable. Well worth the paddle out. He's really well hooked in that top lip. There he is. Oh, he's pooed everywhere. A little stinker. Well, that was a great little session. Got three handy sized snapper like this. Yeah, it's time to head back in. Beauty of this, got a little bit of a breeze up still. We're just going to set the sail up, make life nice and easy for us. Sail at home. All around the thing.